Hello, welcome to the Jenkins Advocacy and Outreach uh, SIG meeting. Today is uh, November 19th. We have several people on the call. Yes, it happens in parallel with KubeCon. So many contributors are there and we will try to make it quick. Okay, if uh, you're at KubeCon, please visit the Continuous Delivery Foundation booth. Uh, you can find a lot of contributors today and we will be happy to discuss any Jenkins, Jenkins X and uh, other uh, ICD related matters uh, at the booth. Okay, um, other news. So we have officially started the JSOC 2021 phase. Um, uh, yeah, JSOC is announced, it's confirmed. There will be some changes to this project, which we discussed yesterday at the office hours. But ultimately, if anyone is interested to join us, or admin, a mentor, or student, please contact us. You can find the information on the uh, uh, project's uh, JSOC page as usual. Okay, sorry. Something is wrong with my cache. Yeah, so you can find all the information here. And yeah, I suggest that we later discuss how we actually organize it this year. Okay, so we have a few topics in the agenda. The first item uh, is from Alisa about a comment strip uh, post. Um, Alisa, would you like to talk about it? Um, yeah, so. We have been given um, three options mm -hmm. from commit strip, and these are just ideas on what we mm -hmm. want, what we would prefer for them to create a comic um, about. And all of these are, um, are based on the work from home idea, which I think I had shared this last time. Um, that we all felt that it was a good idea. Um, so um, I'm not going to go over each of the ideas, but I think, um, let me see. Well, idea number one was not recommended because it's deploying from, from your bed. <laughs> Another place, uh, uh, but by sofa, but yeah. Yeah, so deploying from home um, sounds like a good idea that, you know, you're able mm -hmm. to, of course, this is remote work. So um, the ability to deploy Jenkins from home. Um, yeah, automate everything. So, well, take a look. And then if you can just add input to within the document um, and let us know which ideas um, sounds the most interesting. And we'll go off of that based on everybody's input from there within the document. Mm -hmm. yeah. Let's do that. Okay. Yeah, I'll try to take a look maybe on the weekend. Yeah, that's fine. Thank you, Oleg. Mm -hmm. So anything else regarding comment strip? I think I'm good. Okay. Um, thank you. And yeah, for GSOC 2021, what I wanted to discuss is actually what would be the plan this year? Because last year we had two organizations participating, uh, Jenkins and the CDF. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think um, I think mm -hmm. this is a good good call, Oleg. I think we should probably uh, be a unified front if possible, um, and then um, like I can help coordinate a meeting from all of the community folks, um, and then we can discuss you know next steps on on applying or who wants to be like the the admin, like um, Tara and and you were last year. Um, Cause I think like from the screwdriver side, it'll probably be the Verizon and Yahoo folks who will probably help out. Um, but yeah, it'd be, it'd be good for all of us to just uh, apply as the CDF and then have each of the projects represented. Um, I think that was a missed opportunity last time. Mm -hmm. Plus one for the um, going in all together as part of the CDF. I think that's quite nice. 
And I think that also like helps with like the payment stuff as well. Like <laughs> I think it, um, cause we have to, we end up paying something right to, to sponsor the projects. So I think that also makes the accounting on our side a lot easier. Yeah. Yeah. Think about it and, and let us know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So in my case, uh, yeah, I need to think about it a bit more. Uh, firstly, it really depends on uh, how many projects we target, because uh, yeah, last year we had uh, six projects for Jenkins, one mm -hmm. for Jenkins X, and if, if it was in uh, CDF, it uh, could be perceived as imbalance, because a Jenkins project is considerably bigger than others, and uh, it has a history of uh, GSOC. Yeah. So, um... We will need to think about uh, how we organize it, uh, maybe how we distribute the slots. Um, oh, is that we get a, a limited amount of of project slots? Yeah. Oh, got it, got it, got it. Okay. Um, oh, okay, that's actually a good point. I didn't realize that. Yes. Uh, well, it's rather a technical problem because uh, usually Google is quite generous when it comes mm -hmm. uh, to project slots. Um, and yeah, so far, except one year, we were able to get all slots we asked for. Okay. Uh, so, I'm yeah, maybe sure the, is, is that something that we could um, have a follow up discussion with the mm -hmm. GSOC um, coordinators as well? Um, because it will, like, if, if Jenkins ends up having more proposals. Like, I know Screwdriver um, might not necessarily, I think last time they had maybe like two people mm -hmm. participate so that's also they could just be more flexible with us because we do have we're gonna have probably by then six incubating projects or uh, five incubating and one graduated project mm -hmm. so um yeah let's just ask the question and they might they might be flexible with us and yeah and if they so, say no um, mm -hmm. And then depending on how many each of the projects end up having, then we 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 can consider just Jenkins uh, applying on its own. Yeah. For us, it's really an open question right now. We need to see who would be open to be an ORC admin uh, because yeah, Martin uh, has stepped down because, well, he actually wanted to step down last year, but he helped us uh, mm. get through the year when uh, we had some turbulence in resourcing. I'm not sure what uh, Marcus uh, plans for the next year. Um, yeah, basically it would uh, leave us with current me handling uh, organization side, unless somebody else uh, steps up. So uh, we will need to decide uh, by mid-January. By mid-January. Okay, um, so should we coordinate a meeting then by like early December to understand mm -hmm. which of the projects A want to participate and then um, and then we'll then but on that we can decide like org admins and then we can also set a deadline of like how many, you know, if you're going to submit a project, submit it now so that we can go and have that conversation with Google. Um, I'm quite happy to throw my hat in the ring as an org admin for, for Jenkins. Um, I, I don't know whether or not Jenkins X, we had one student last year and that went really well. It was great, great work that he did, mm -hmm. but um, I don't know if Jenkins X will participate next year. I, I'll ask and we'll see, but um, I'm happy to help out with the admin regardless. Yeah. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, and, and that's the thing. I don't know if, if Spinnaker is yeah. going to uh, participate, and I don't know if Screwdriver is going to, uh, and then if Tecton is either, because they are, they, they're a little bit um, less uh, organized, I think, on the community front to, for that stuff sometimes. Um, so that's why I'm also like, well, let's, let's just see who wants to participate, and then we can have that conversation with Google. We can go ask them. Never. Yeah, we can leverage Tara as well. Um, mm -hmm. in, in that conversation, she might be able to help us pull some strings. Yep. Let's um, discuss it uh, in the next weeks. So again, uh, no immediate decision uh, needed. Uh, but yeah, having a single organization 
could help uh, okay. consolidate things. Okay, so yeah, mm -hmm. if we can put it on the agenda for December 3rd, and then I'll forward, I'm going to add a few people to that meeting then, Oleg. So like I'll invite the Verizon wireless folks mm -hmm. and Yahoo folks and the, and the Armory folks um, and see if they want to participate. Again, I added it to the agenda. Okay. Any other topics to discuss today? Or should we close early and go to KubeCon? Oh, like I have one yeah. for, mainly for Jackie since um, I okay. have her here. But um, Jackie, is Jesse Kassman still with CDF? Yes, he is. He has a new ad, um, email address. Oh, so okay. I'll send that to you. Um, okay. after after we get off this call okay perfect yeah, so that sorry answers. about that <laughs> no worries okay or, yeah oracle is kind of like oh what, what are we going to do what do you guys want to do so all right no we're good thank you okay. mm -hmm. thanks all like yeah thanks all so uh, see you at the city of both side guys okay. see you later bye bye bye, bye.